Celeste Sassine calls baking one of her great loves. The Queens Village mom opened Sassy Sweet Vegan Treats in 2018. I love serving the community. I love people tasting my goods and saying, this is vegan? No way. Sassine largely runs the business online. That's why she says it's important for her to attend events like the Queen's Chamber of Commerce's Business Expo. There are bankers here. There are investments here. Uh, possibility for grants here. There are other businesses that I can connect with that people that I don't know that I need to know because you don't know what your future holds. And she wasn't the only one. Dozens of groups, most based in Queens, attended the expo. It's the vibe. It's the crowd. Queens has got $40 billion of projects. They want to be part of that. The expo takes place every year and highlights the opportunities that exist in the borough. For 100 years, Queens was the place you traveled through. Now it's the place you travel to. It's all about jobs, jobs, jobs. I don't want the smart kids of Queens that come to Queens, that live in Queens, to go anywhere else. I want them to live, work, and play right here. $40 million to fund those startups. $40 million. Thank you. At the event, the Chamber of Commerce also announced the Queens Innovation Foundation, which will raise $40 million for local tech startups. Mesh, a Bluetooth tracking system for caregivers, is one of them. Kian Nam from Bayside is the founder. She says it's inspiring to see so much investment in the borough. I always believe that Queens is actually the future tech hub. So much resources, especially people. People are so smart in Queens. I believe in people in Queens. And we have land.